Welcome everyone to MMO Good to Go. This is Kelsendale bringing you a first look at Eden Eternal. Eden Eternal in China is known as Finding Neverland Online. It's developed by X Legend and published by Area Games. It is a fancy MMO RPG, I think. Anyways, before we get started, uh, let me remind you to go ahead and subscribe if you enjoy the video. Don't forget to hit thumbs up, thumbs down if you do or don't. Also, leave a comment on Facebook, not on here, well I guess you could leave it there, but on Facebook or Twitter and uh, at MMO, good to go, and uh, just let me know if there's a game that you would like to see, or I don't know, maybe you want to play me 1v1 in Smite or something like that, I don't, it's up to you, but uh, just hit me up and uh, I'll get back with you on that. Now if that's out of the way, let's go ahead and get started. We have here two servers with one has four, one has six channels. Uh, I'll go ahead and start with uh, channel one. Why not, right? <clears throat> create a character. So, creating a character. Well, here, it only tells you what to do. How convenient. Go ahead and put our name in. We could pick our race. On this side, we have human, Zumi, Anura, Ursin, and a Halfkin. Halfkin of what? Don't know. Here's a male, female. Here's a beaver. Gender locked. There's a frog. Gender locked. Actually, I'll probably be the frog. Gender locked as well. And a halfkin. Maybe it's just short. There's your female. Oh. Okay. <clears throat> Anyways, I'm gonna be a freaking toad because that's awesome. And uh. Golly, I can't remember what they were called. What were the battle toads called? Dang it! Anyways, so we have warrior, knight. These are the different things you get. A templar that you get based on your level. So you have level 60, level 60, 25, beginning job, and so forth. So up here at the top we have a warrior, a thief. A hunter, cleric, a magician, and he's not class locked. Oh, but you can't see his weapons. This is completely in the way. How do I get rid of this? Hmm. Might have to pause it right here. Oh, you know what? I can't even go into settings yet because I haven't gotten that far. I don't see a settings button anywhere. <clears throat> I'll do that later. Helmet. Wow, that is super annoying. Does it switch? Okay, let's do that. I want to see the front. What am I in? A hunter? He's not ranged? Oh yeah, there's his bow. Hunter, engineer. Love using explosives and machines to prove the worthiness of technology in battle. Uh, thief. Self-explanatory. Probably a DPS, same as the Hunter, Cleric, Heals, and a Magician. I normally go Mage, but I think I'm going to go the Warrior, my Tank. Um, these are preview items, so it. I mean, I can click on all these all day and just preview. I don't like how I can't see his face. That's kind of annoying. <clears throat> Speaking of faces, blink, 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 hurry up! Okay, here's I1, I2, I3, 4, 5. Not a terrible amount to choose from. We'll go with that skin. I like the purple. Eyes, can't see. Oh, you know what? Well, let's keep going. green okay and my class I don't want to be a thief I usually choose mage I'm not gonna choose mage you know what no verify I may use my own name yay Whoa. heroic trait okay they're not name specific things oh leadership guardian apostle commando 
Crackshot, Adventure, and Maverick. Um, I'm guessing they all are going to pay. I'll probably be that one just because I'm physical melee, right? Whatever. Play a part later on. Um, crappy. I have no weapon. Select class. So that's what I'm going to be. Luminary. What is this? Two unyielding sword spirits intertwine darkness and light become one uniting and destroying anything and everything that stands in your way. You know what? That sounds awesome. Wait. Uh, yeah. That's... Enter a password. <sighs> okay, I'm going to pause it here and then come back. That was annoying. Anyways, <clears throat> let's go ahead. They are old as the planet itself. I missed the first part. Each race found a reason to brave the well, little masses arrive at the central continent, exhausted but triumphant, and started new lives. As time passed, the rising tensions from the power struggles, blah blah blah, became even more explosive. Tragedies and havoc became the norm. A shroud of suffering and misery descended upon the beautiful land. I can only assume this land, seeing as how it's over there. Suddenly, a squad of young heroes arrived. They commanded immense power! Just out of nowhere. Just... POWER! And possessed wisdom. Blah blah blah. More importantly, seemed to conjure a brand of magic that could expel evil and foster... Wow, that is annoying. They say... These saviors were born of the blue crystal. And that they came to this world to help the citizens build a utopia. The ancient Grimori call this collective the Eternal Guardians. I guess that's what I'm either going to fight or going to be. The Bergen... Bergen... Heroes... <laughs> I can't read. I'm sorry. They thirst for justice. Prepared to face down evil without an ounce of fear. These champions must keep the fragile light of hope. Something flickering within the hearts of innocents around the world. It's so noble. I think I'm going to cry. Not really. Oh, the lamb. Yeah. He looks like a lamb sheep thingy with crossed with a llama. Bad llama. Okay, the sound of burbling water awakened you. The pool next to you seems to radiate blue light. You quickly felt a kinship with the blue crystal in its center. Oddly energized, you realized your mind was blank. You only remember your name, Kelsendel. As you tried to make sense of it all, you turned to see an Anura in light armor murmuring prayers. Press L to view the hot Gweski, whatever. Oh. Except, so now I gotta turn and look to my left. So, there's ASWD, discovered. You know what, I'm gonna pause it here and I'm gonna fix my stuff, because this is annoying. Alright, sorry about that everyone. Let's go ahead and get started. So, ASWD is to move, right click. Makes me look up and down. Center click, zoom in and out, which I'll probably be right here. Left click. Left click, spin, right click, spin me. Okay. Got all my buttons here. ASWD uh, says right here. So now that I've looked at that, let's go ahead and complete this quest. Right click to confirm. Bam. Close. Accept my new quest. Uh, relieved to learn that you were okay, but he was wasted no time in showing you a prop. Wow, that's horrible. On an ancient tablet, it proved a oh, prophecy, something, whatever. I don't like that at all. You are no longer in a quest. Well, let's see what the quest log says. Shift left click. Close. Let's see, zoom out. There it is. Let's see what you are. Uh, seems a little 
Space bar is jump. Ding ding. Okay. Except, I'm sorry I'm not reading these because it takes too freaking long to read my questies. Let's see, map is M, P is events, K is... What did I press? <coughs> see what transform is. Oh, I did something. Switch. Oh, what did I do? I broke it. You've learned unshakable. K should be the skill tree, no? Skills. Deep impact. So let's see. They're not locked. Oh. So we grab them. Wait, is it a passive? I didn't even check. No, it's not passive. Increases my attack. Wow, 103 points. What is my health then? 389. That's not that high. Hmm. I won't worry about it later. There's my character. Whoop. On blue aviator shades by crystal transformation. You know what? Let's go find something to kill. One bam. That's what you get, birdie. Tab, of course. Scroll through the enemy. Leaving combat. Got a potion. Yay, potion! Auto attack. Oh, I finished my quest. You're gonna die, clown. Hmm. Brom. Prophecy Keeper Fame Chest. I don't really like the... It, the controls seem a little weird. I don't know. It could just be me. I haven't played a... an RPG in a little while, to be quite honest. It just seems really... I don't like how it's locked like that. Like, immediately I press L or, I mean, uh, A and D, or D, and it just, what's this? Upgrade, Deep Impact 2, did it automatically switch? Let's see. Eh, probably did. This tree is located in the swamp, in the center. Well, good, because that's where I'm going. You know, I didn't even check to see what his level was. Level 3. And I'm... What is this? Do you have acquired a state? Yay, I got Texas. Who are you? Ooh, a tranquil portal. I want to go through the portal. Nope. Hang on. I need to read. About the meteor shower, what is astrolite? By astrolite compass. Let's read with this. I'll find blah blah blah. Every kind of astrolite beauty and potential, but as you travels, you will discover clues regarding the astrolites. Finish all the way. Okay, level eight. Okay, whatever. So I can't get it yet. Ugh. Wait. I dropped my weapons. Character sheet. B is bag. When did I pick up these? So... Ah. So it's one, two, and three. Okay. Huh. Interesting. Or... Wait, when? What? 
the deuce did I do? I broke my character. Oh, that's what that was. So... I could do fusion! skill okay <coughs> excuse me so let's go back into the character sheet uh, I is item mall B system requirements not ret met Oh, maybe I have to have a certain luminary. <sighs> Did I? S uh. Oh, that's what it is. Okay, so I switched back to luminary. Now I can equip my swords. Gotcha. Light armor is what the Luminaire wears. So. I'll just put it all on, right? Why not? Oop! Nope. There we go. Okay. I do like that I could choose my weapons. Bam! Ooh, that looked nice. I like that. Let's see that again. Boom! Maybe I should attack something far. Wait, can I? Oh, I can't. I was wondering if I can kite using it. So he's more like a battle mage. Gotcha. I can't auto walk. Well, there you go. Oh, let me see what my quest is. Go! Oh, wait. <laughs> Talk to Zane. Mm. So I talked to Zane. Now I report to this guy here. Close. Except. Oh wait. Go. Collect. Ancient something. Warp. Soul grain. From who? <laughs> Ancient stone slate. From Luca. Where the deuce is Luca? He won't let me go. I gotta f manually walk myself over there. Let's see what you say. Dang. Oop. Do 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 do. You don't jump that high at all. Not as high as I would like. <clears throat> I guess I should say. 
Raku. Um. Hmm. Someone help me. 3v3, 43, 49 arena, please. See? That's what I thought. Oh, <laughs> find the turtles. I knew that. I was just checking to see. Oh, uh, that doesn't work. Turtle, turtle. Let's see. Nope, can't farm with that either. Man, that was a crit hit if ever. Nailed him. <laughs> I can kite you though. Look at that. Such crap. And it comes up so fast, I'll never get hit. Again. I think I'm level 3. Potion. Bam. Quest item. Wow. Okay, I believe it was. What is this? License knowledge. Glow burst for every level up and crit damage increases by 1%. Twin light shadow blade. And I got two points. And I don't see where it says points. Ah, one point. For every level up increases the damage of light split. Hmm. There didn't seem to be very much. There we go. Class skills. Oh, upgrade. Upgrade again. 52 silver. Oh man, that does do more damage. Look at that. Oh, I wonder if I also have points over here to to put around. Heroic trait, so I could do a luminary. What is this level then? I got. <laughs> that's weird. <laughs> I'm wondering if it's because I can switch between the classes. I have two different levels on each class. I don't know. Anyways, <clears throat> that's going to go ahead and do it for this first look at Eden Eternal. Any questions or comments can be left below. And uh, I will be doing a second look on this video for sure. Also, I'll be doing a Let's Play video soon of The Witcher, the first one, and then I'll do the second one. And uh, maybe I'll be done by the time the third one gets done. I was going to do Fallout, but I suck at Fallout so bad. And I was having a lot of recording issues. Um, my computer just did not like recording Fallout. I don't know what it was. Anyways, this is Kelsendale, and this MMO is good to go.